the hardest question I could find for trigonometry. Now this is specifically for right angle trigonometry. I will make separate videos for the sine and the cosine rule as well. So without wasting any time, calculate the exact area of the semicircle. Obviously to calculate the exact area of the semicircle, we're going to need the radius, which means we're going to need the hypotenuse of that triangle. So first of all, to be able to get the hypotenuse, we need this length here, down here. And to do that, we will have to use Pythagoras. So to get the b squared, let's say, it's going to be c squared minus a squared. So b is going to equal the square root of 11 squared minus 7 squared. So b is equal to 6 root 2, which is that length there. Now from here, it might be helpful to just redraw our triangle on its own. So here is what it will look like. We have the right angle here, 6 root 2, the 30, and we want the h here. Now we currently have the adjacent, which means we're going to be using cos. So cos of 30 equals the adjacent, which is 6 root 2, over our hypotenuse. And then we would do 6 root 2 divided by cos 30, and that will get us our hypotenuse. So x is equal to 4 root 6. Now that is going to be the entire diameter of the semicircle. So we want to half that, which will be 2 root 6 from the center to the outside. And then we would do pi r squared divided by 2. And that is going to be our area of a semicircle. And that is equal to exactly 24 pi. And that is the hardest question for right angle trigonometry. Thank you for watching. Hope this helps and good luck in your exams.